Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Gento. NBA 2K14 on the next-gen consoles, they they outdid themselves. So, with everything that's been said, the number one thing that has caught my attention so far has to be my career mode. Now, we all know what my career mode was. Well, I better say we thought we knew what my career mode was because on the next gen, they took it to a whole nother level. So basically, next gen my career mode, it actually puts you into your my player's shoes. There's over 40 hours of cutscenes in your first season alone. And it's not said whether it's gonna be more new cutscenes after that, I hope so. Cause that would definitely keep people hooked. I know it's gonna keep me coming back for more. Cause 40 hours worth of cutscenes? That's like a GTA game. That's like a GTA story or something like that. Now, basically in the cutscenes, you're gonna see your my player interacting with his rival, agents, GM, friends, and more. And press conferences. Hopefully the press conference is longer too. I'm pretty sure it is because in current gen, the only cutscenes you would see would be pre-game. You get hype, you give your little speech, you talk to your GM, and your press conference. That's only three cutscenes at most. That's about 15 minutes worth in next gen. They're giving you 40 hours worth. And they said that there's something about this guy. I forgot his name. I'm pretty sure that they're going to bring back the 2K Insider. Remember in 2K11, the 2K Insider gave you a heads up on everything. When you're upgrading skills, you're just going to hear him saying, hey, don't upgrade that. You don't need that. Save your skill points, boost this. So to actually see him interact with you, to actually see your my player interacting with your rival, a heated rivalry between you and your my player you're my player and you're I was gonna call him a my rival <laughs> you're my player and a rival that'll be ridiculous and now one thing that actually caught my attention there's so much detail that's been put into this game mode you can finally get brand new hairstyles tattoos accessories and when they said leg tattoos that leads me to believe that there's gonna be facial tattoos neck tattoos all around you can be fully tatted if you want i hope because every single game had great tattoos saints row gta 5 ufc a lot of games that i've played that actually let you play and create your guy and put tattoos on them their tattoos were great they actually let you put the tattoo exactly where you want so to see that 2k has finally allowed us to do that that's a great thing and then another thing I got to point out. So you got that, right? There's another thing. There's this conversation engine. With the conversation engine, it actually gives those computer players, the AI, a memory bank. So they actually can remember. So let's say Rookie Showcase. Let's say I embarrass my rival. My rival's talking trash, right? And I just say, man, I'm going to hit 60 on you. I'm going to break your ankles. I'm going to go and pop threes in your face. There's going to be nothing you can do because you can't guard me. Trash talking back, right? So he's going to remember that. My rival's going to remember all the trash that I talked to him. And down the road, let's say my career goes downhill because of this injury I get. Let's say I tore my ACL and I've never been able to play the same since. So then next thing you know, my rival might say, hey, remember what you said in Rookie Showcase? While well, he's just showing, flashing his six rings or something, you know? But that's just something I like. So much attention to detail has been put into this game. And I know for a fact, I'm going to hop on to this, my career. It's I'm just hooked right now. I wish, I can't wait to actually see the my career footage because when they said they seen it they were hype and one more thing i want to point out is this parks mode so basically what parks is it's a hundred i guess a hundred people max can go and just go to the park a lot of people were saying that it's just like cruise you know I, I guess they it'll be more like blacktop because cruise was basically just blacktop mode with your own uniform so I'm hoping it's more like blacktop so I can wear my street clothes and just ball with everybody else and since it's a hundred people all on one court or should I say in one park with dozens of other courts you could probably just say hey I don't want to play this game 
I just want to chill and watch the other guy play. I want to see what he can do. I haven't seen him ball in a minute. Let me see if he still has it or something like that. So that will be cool if you can actually spectate. But other than that, I can't wait till I get my hands on. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe. Till next time.